I was sitting in front of Macho Man and Hulk one time, and they were going to meet, I think, for the first time. And Hulk Hogan sat down, and it took about a few seconds before Hulk said, well, brother, you know, I'm going to go ahead and do that big leg at the end there, you know? And uh, and Macho Man went, oh, yeah, I know, I know. But he says, uh, you know me, there he said, go up the top rope there, you know? And he says, uh, he does that big flying elbow yeah. off the top. He says, I want to do that. So Hulk looked at him, and he says, uh, no problem. And then Hulk says, yeah, yeah, but you know, he says, then I'm going to do this. And then he was saying, I'm going to do that. And, then, and it was so funny because we were in England. I was main event against Macho Man for the belt in England, in London. And Miss Elizabeth, was, so we went to sat down. I was so excited because I was working with Randy, you know, but my, my Mountie character was so over in Europe because of the soldiers they have over there and all of it. Anyway, so, so I was really over big time in Europe. And I was sitting in front of Randy one day, and I told Randy, I said, uh, I said, hey, Randy, I said, you know, I'm so happy to work with you. And he says, well, you know, he says, uh, then he starts, well, you know, because I asked him, well, you know, how's, how we're going to work this out? He says, well, I said, but before you start, Randy, and then he looked at me, he was so pissed off, like I took it, <laughs> I was going to talk for him. I said, before you start, Randy, I said, I got to tell you something. You know, when you go up that top rope and you give that big elbow, Oh, yes, yeah. I, I want to take that. I said, I'm going to sell that good for you. And I said, you know, oh, yeah, okay, I'll do that at the end. And I said, well, wait a minute, Randy. I said, you know that other thing you do when you start running into the ropes and you jump over the top and you guillotine the guy's neck on the rope and he takes... I want you to do that to me. I said, you watch the bump I'm going to take. You're going to like this. So I'm going on for about two minutes about things like he likes to do. And then finally looks at me and he says, yeah, but what are you going to do? <laughs> I says, well, I don't know. Well, he says, you give a good drop kick, you know, and this. I said, why don't you? I saw you give the drop down top. Why don't you do that at this point? And then he started giving and giving. It was easy, the solution. I knew that solution. And it worked. And we had a hell of a match. Better than I ever expected. It's too bad it wasn't filmed. So, so, so long story short is, uh, to be generous, I'm thinking of Steve Lombardi. I'm going back to Steve. He was like that. Yeah. And he was always saying, what do you want to do? What do you want to do? What do you want to do? And that goes far in this business. Yeah, indeed. It, goes far. it definitely does. You know, another uh, another opponent that we share in common, believe it or not, and it actually goes back to the first time I saw